Well, a street in southwest Houston is being used as a cut through, and some people living along that street say that the drivers are just speeding down the road. Neighbors say people are zipping down Burdine Street between Belfort and Chimney Rock, and that's where we find Eyewitness News reporter Adela Uchita. She has a story all new at 6.30 tonight. Adela? Well, Alona, Burdine Street between Chimney Rock and West Belford is a residential street. There are apartment complexes on either side of the street. The neighbors here say they want all the cars and the buses to slow down before someone gets hurt. This short stretch of Burdine Street is a convenient little cut through from Chimney Rock near Westbury High School and West Belford. The traffic is horrendous. And the speed limit is 30 miles per hour. That's going faster than 30. But every afternoon, A.B. Kupfer, who lives on Burdine, says lots of cars are coming through here faster than they're supposed to. I just want people to be safe and careful on the street because someone's going to get hurt. Already, Kupfer says pets have fallen victim to speeders. Chihuahuas getting run over, cats getting run over. It doesn't have to happen. So he wants the drivers to slow down. He says he's reached out to city council member Larry Green, who told us he'd passed on concerns to HPD and given Kupfer an application for changes to the street, changes that might include speed bumps or other traffic abatements. But according to Alvin Wright with the city's public works department, that requires a neighborhood study, public comment meetings, and must be approved by city council. It takes months, and it's not a quick fix. It's going to be a while, plus the fact is that once we go up, we do the study, it may actually uncover other issues which might not be to the events of the community as well, too. In the meantime, the Houston Police Department told me on the phone that the Southwest Patrol had no record of any complaints, but would work with Kupfer to get the speeders to slow down. Maybe not the immediate answer Kupfer had hoped for. I lived for 15 years, and this started up two years ago being this bad. Now, Councilmember Green told me on the phone that speed bumps on Burdine are unlikely because this is a pretty major cut through between two major streets, but that other possibilities could happen. It could take months. The immediate relief would come through HPD. Patrols Kupfer told me that he has since been in touch with the uh, Southwest Patrol once again. We have yet to see any officers out here. Live in Southwest Houston, Adele Uchita, 13 Eyewitness News.